going to be talking advice. Should you give advice to someone who did not ask for it? Now there are times, and I've said this before, that your parents, your siblings, your close friends, God love them, they don't tell you what you need to hear, they tell you what you want to hear, because they care about you, they don't want to hurt your feelings, right? But there might be something that you're doing that, you really need to just stop that, you just need to just, mm -mm, not anymore, you know? And someone who doesn't know you very well might be the person to tell you, look, I don't think you should be posting those kind of statuses or those kind of pictures or you should be doing that in the workplace or you should be seeing that guy or girl. Like they might be just keeping it real with you because they actually have your best interests at heart. The thing is, it's risky. Giving advice to someone who did not ask for it is risky because one, they might just be like, did I ask you bruv? Oh, I'm, I'm really sorry, I just, I just can't remember asking you. Your mum. Okay, the last response was probably a bit extreme and I wouldn't expect that from anyone above the age of 11, but you never know. No, I will admit, I'll put my hands up. I'm not hands up, put your hands up. Just got northern all of a sudden. I'll put my hands up and admit that I don't like it. Didn't ask you, don't come round here with your advice, yeah? <laughs> However, if there is an area that you can improve on and someone has taken the time to help you out with that or advise you on that and it's come from a good place, I definitely think you need to process it and take it on board because at the end of the, end of the day, we all wanna be better, right? Having said all this, it's not black and white because there are some people out there who are just serial advice givers and they're not necessarily qualified to give you advice um, on the area that they're talking about. So it might be, I don't know, a skill you have or your work or something, right? Um, and they just feel like they need to give you advice in that accent. Yeah, not, I'm not a fan when it comes from those people. But like I said, those closest to you might not always have the, I don't want to say balls, might not have the heart to tell you what you need to hear, might not have the heart to give you the advice that will maybe help you. So if it comes from elsewhere, it might be worth a listen. What do you think? Should you give advice? to someone who has not asked you for it. Let me know. We're gonna discuss it on my show, Monday, 6 to 8 p.m. on House 559. Get involved with the conversation. Let's have a chat and listen to some great music. Yeah. See you then.